ears can't hear the sound of the tongue. Reach the skies, we'll fly up to the moon. I know we'll be there soon. Wait and see. Hello everyone. Today I am doing an outfit of the day video. I am wearing burgundy or plum with slate gray and black accessories. And for a lighter color, I'm using off-white or I guess it's almost an ivory with pearls to match. This is my dressy pant uniform. You've seen me wear this type of uniform many times before. My pants today are side zip. They are, I guess you would say, a straight leg, straight leg, maybe a bit tapered to the ankle. These are full length on me. My jewelry is also timeless. It's pearls and pearl earrings. These pearls are between nine and 10 millimeter in terms of the size of the pearl. This is a 16 inch length. Uh, this pair of earrings, these are, gosh, so old. They were given to me in 1989. I've talked about this before when I was a bridesmaid in a wedding, all the bridesmaids got these. I just think they're so pretty. They're 14 karat gold, sweet little dangles. I wear them a lot. My ring is a ring that was my mother's. It combines pearls and diamonds and yellow gold. And my bracelet is, gosh, it's quite old. It was given to me in 1996 by my grandmother. It consists of charms that my father collected for my grandmother during the 1960s and the 1970s when he was traveling all over the world for business. He would get one in a city where he was and give it to my grandmother. And so she put them all on a bracelet. My mother did the same, so she has one as well. But this is so fun to see all the different places my father went in his work years. My father has since passed away, so it's another reason why I love this bracelet. It reminds me of him. And then on this arm, I am wearing my Cartier watch. This is the tank watch, which I've shown you before, and my wedding set. And that is my jewelry for today. This is from, I think I bought this in 2018. It is the Chanel Chevron Chic bag. It is in the Chevron pattern in textured calf leather. It has a removable, adjustable shoulder strap. They made this bag, I believe, two years, 2018 and 19, or whatever the year was I bought it, and the next year, and then it disappeared. The year I bought this, there was a new bag out called the Coco Handle. And I remember wanting specifically a back black bag, and I looked at the Coco Handle in this size. I looked at the medium, Chanel classic flap in black caviar leather and in the end decided to buy this bag because of the shoulder strap. I don't believe at that time the coco handle strap was removable. If you all know differently let me know but it, I believe it wasn't at that time. It was definitely shorter and the classic flap also the short the shoulder strap was shorter and it didn't have a top, top handle so ultimately i bought this bag i'm so happy i did i love this handbag because of all the gold hardware for one and the reason i chose it over the coco handle at that time was because it was slimmer the coco handle is a gorgeous bag i did go on to purchase it later it's puffier though it has the diamond quilting and it's puffier it also doesn't have as much gold on it nor does it have an adjustable strap. So that's the reason why I fell in love with this bag. Inside, it is roomy for a little bag, but I don't have it filled with very much. 
my perfume today is Christian Dior, Lady Dior. You can see it has the classic quilting that is on the Lady Dior handbag. Also in my handbag is my Chanel mirror in his pouch. That's all in the front compartment along with my Kleenex. This is pebbled leather. You can see the Kleenex is in here. Ah, oh, excuse me, it's faux pebbled leather. It's not real pebbled leather. In the back compartment is my makeup pouch. This is leather monogrammed. It's available in a variety of colors. In it, I have my dual sided lip brush and sanitizer and my lip color today. I forgot to use my hand sanitizer at lunch today. <laughs> oh well, it doesn't do me much good if I don't use it, does it? <laughs> my lip color I'm wearing currently it is the color Ruby Mineral Fusion. This is a very moisturizing lip color and it lasted through lunch quite well. I still had full color on my lips. It did not come off in a funny pattern. It stayed on my lips. Is that everything now? I have one more thing in here, my card holder. Two slots on this side two slots on this side, and then the rest of my cards and cash are in the zipper compartment. I will link to something similar down below. This is an old Tory Burch one, but look at how well it holds up. It's Tory Burch makes wonderful handbags and small leather goods. Really wonderful. Is that everything? I believe that is everything. So that is the inside of my bag. Now, I do not have felt inserts because this one was not a standard classic that is easy to get inserts for. So if anybody knows of any that fit and you have this bag, please let me know. I would love to get felt inserts to protect the interior and keep the shape. My sunglasses, which have my hair all over the place because I like to put them on and off my top of my head, are these black ones. I have these in tortoise as well and a similar pair in pink. I love these sunglasses. They come in a variety of, goodness, this site has a variety of frames to choose from. This particular frame, you can choose whether you want narrow, medium, or wide width. You can choose whether you want black tortoise or there may be another color from which to choose, I don't remember. I think you can choose the lens color in some cases. I love this size. It's a bit oversized, but not too much. I think it's just the perfect size of sunglasses. As I said, I have a similar pair in pink and the exact same pair in tortoise. These are great sunglasses. Why don't I put them on top of my head? It'll keep my hair in place. Is that everything? I think I have told you everything. I've talked about my jewelry, my clothing, accessories, my handbag. Getting back to my makeup. As I said, everything I'm wearing is from clean makeup brands. My foundation is from Gabriel. My blush is from Gabriel. Eyeshadow from Gabriel. My mascara and primer is from Honest Beauty. Eyeshadow, did I mention that's Gabriel? My setting powder is RMS Beauty. Lip color was Mineral Fusion, I mentioned that. I think that is all my makeup products. For salad dressing, I carried my tote bag. And this black pouch is perfect size for these bottles that I have. They do not leak. I recommend them highly if you want to 
carry dressing in glass bottles so you don't have to worry about allergies to anything being put on your salads. These bottles are wonderful. I've been buying them for, I don't know, since 20, gosh, 10 years, more. Never had one leak. I still bag them up twice and put them in pouches nevertheless. But these pouches are really handy. See, they've got all these compartments if you want to use them for cosmetics or something else. But perfect size for salad dressing. And you can still fit a lot of items in there. So I just put those in a black canvas tote. That is everything. If you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comments section down below here at YouTube or on Facebook or Instagram or on my blog. Coming up next is my outfit. Thank you so much for watching my video and I will talk to you in my next 